Okay. Hey everybody, it's Ruthie, and today we are going to be vlogging a little. We are back at it, doing it to him yet again. We're going to Bodeborg, year two, 2019. So we're gonna go get lunch at Quincy Market before we head. We have like a 3.30 reservation for Bodeborg, and hopefully this year we meet the potions room. That was like the one room we had like a really hard time completing, and obviously, we haven't completed all the other rooms too. So there's a lot that we have to try and beat, so. We are here at the, at the Orange Line and we're going to take it in. Um, we're gonna go to Faneuil Hall and get lunch with Carter and Molly. We're gonna meet them there and then we're gonna come back here for our reservation at Vodeboard. <laughs> we're inside Faneuil Hall right now. We're waiting to get some mac and cheese. It's really busy, but it's really, really good. Good mac and cheese. Yeah, Reagan and Mackenzie love it a lot. You can. It is certified. So good. Yeah. So <laughs> it's gonna take a while to get, but it'll be worth it, I think. Hello. Um, we're on our way back to Bodeborg right now. Oh, we're in the subway. T. We're in the T. The T station. Um, and we're about to get back on. Look at Reagan and Mackenzie's ice cream. It's in a boat. It's in a boat. We stopped really quickly at the Gary Deli store and they always get they always flip this Sunday. Oh we're going down. Okay so we are here at Bodeborg and we are getting ready to get started. Um, <laughs> we're really excited to get into it. Hopefully we solve all the ones we didn't solve last year and I don't know. We're gonna have a good time. I'm excited. Let's go. <laughs> also while I was doing this take literally like three employees of Bodeborg were staring at me the whole time, so it was really uncomfortable. Okay, so we're a few hours into Bodeborg. We've been here for like three hours at this point, I think, and we've solved like three rooms, which is kind of sad, but that's okay. We solved a lot of the new ones. We solved Sphinx, we solved Spycatcher, and we're working, wait, what was the other one we played? Sphinx, Spycatcher, Spy Catcher, and Jungle! And we beat Jungle, which was a really hard one that I've been waiting <laughs> to solve for like years now. So we have, as you can see, there's a lot of rooms that we've tried and haven't quite gotten. We're still working on potions. It's quite difficult, but we're trying to solve it. And there's a lot of ones that we've solved pretty easily last year that we just haven't gotten to. So... Okay, we just finished up with Bodeborg. We've been... It's... 10 o'clock, so we've been here for six and a half hours, and oh <laughs> we completed potions, we did it! I am literally so excited. Thank you so much to the beautiful, beautiful soul that works here that helped us out. Honestly, you're a G. You're a G, and we love you. We don't know your name, but we love you anyways. Um, we solved a lot of other rooms, too. We actually got through a lot. Um, let me get my stamp. Kevin, Dan, and I did every part of this show. All three of them. We finished them all. all three. So here's what we got. This is what we've got so far on our stamp card. Um, or my stamp card. <laughs> our stamp cards. Yeah. So it was it was a fairly productive night tonight. Um, we're getting kicked out now. We're trying to decide where we're gonna go eat dinner, and we really should be leaving because everyone's here. So let's rock and roll. Right, guys so that is the end of my Bodeborg vlog thank you guys so much for watching I'm sorry it was really really short I didn't take like any b-roll to cut in with any of my like vlogging sections which are awkward and awful anyways because I'm not a good in public vlogger it makes me very uncomfortable because everyone always looks at me but that's okay I did it anyways and we're probably gonna do it again but um yeah uh, I had a lot of fun with Vodaborg. If you guys are in the Boston area or like Massachusetts around there, I would 100% recommend it. It's really cheap, so you can go for as long as you want for $33, and you can go for two hours for $22, but honestly, definitely go unlimited because there's so much to do. And like you guys saw, we were there for six hours and we only solved like 10 of the rooms which is probably like half maybe maybe even like less than half because there's multiple ways to solve some of the rooms 
but anyways, if you have you and yourself and a couple of friends, I would 100% recommend doing it. I'm sorry I haven't been uploading too much over the summer. I kind of fell off. There's been some stuff I wanted to talk about, but nothing that's been like such a big deal. Like I had to make a video about it, but I'm ready to get back into the school year and kind of get back into a regular upload schedule. Um, I just started as um, editor for one of my friends YouTube channels, Gwen, and she is in the middle of her Peach Time series, um, which is a series all about peaches. And you can go check out her channel. I'll link it in the iCard. Um, and you guys can go check that out. It would mean a lot to both of us. Um, I've had a lot of fun editing for her. So yeah, um, I hope you guys are doing good. I hope to have at least one more video up before I go back to school because it's kind of lame that I haven't done anything this summer. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in the next one. Hopefully that's pretty soon. Okay, bye!